theme, Art in a New Light, takes place at Obrick Gardens once again this fall. And here to tell us more about the event and the opening of the event, we have Katie Plantenberg of Obrick Gardens. Good morning. Good morning. Now, Katie, this you started last year. Mm -hmm. And explain what Gleam is, just an overview. Gleam, it's an outdoor art installation. We have um, seven different artists or pairs of artists that have collaborated with lighting designers. Mm -hmm. uh, and so these pieces are installations into the outdoor gardens and then light is a major component of each one. So we have special evening viewing times that people can come see these amazing art pieces all lit up. And this runs all the way through the end of October, mm -hmm. so you have plenty of opportunity. Yeah, there's plenty of opportunity. We're open a couple days a week. It's not every day um, okay. per week, so check out the website for the exact um, dates and times. But you can come see it during the day, but then at night, yeah, it turns into something totally different. And so tell us a little bit about some of these artists that are, and, and what kinds of things are they doing? Sure. Um, there's one called uh, Yahara waters Yahara clouds and it is kind of a topographical um, look at the two lakes here oh yeah so that one will be in our rose garden we have a projection artist as well um, there's some there's one called fire monkeys uh, that one should be really fun and then just a whole bunch I mean there's seven so you're you'll be surprised by what you see And most of the artists are right from our local area yeah they are they're pretty much Madison surrounding area in Milwaukee and then how do they present um, what they're going to do to you mm -hmm. to, to be part of the show? Sure, it's a juried process. Um, so they apply, they have kind of a little bit of an idea of what they're going to do, and they submit an application, and they're reviewed, and then the artists are selected, and they're paired with their lighting designers, and then it goes from there. So the artists must have a view of how they want it lit, or that's what the lighting designer does? I think they usually have a little bit of an idea of how they okay. would like it lit, but um, the lighting designers really are able to help out with that and really make that come to life and use the light in the best way. And this is really a unique time to get out and enjoy Ulbrich Gardens. Mm -hmm. It's not normally open in the evening or especially at night. So what do people do when they arrive? Sure, um, they come in, um, purchase a ticket, and then we send them on their way outside. All of the paths around the route are lit, and okay. so it's beautiful. It's beautiful to just walk. Um, you don't have to worry about getting lost. We'll, we'll guide you around, and we have some very friendly volunteers outside, too, that'll help you along the way, and then you can just stroll. And then they'll make sure that you get to see all of them, too, because yeah. that's important. Yep, they'll help you if you miss one, and they'll get you. We give you a map, so you... you be sure to see them all. Now, the big opening event is coming up on Friday. Tell us about mm -hmm. that. Um, we have our opening on Friday. It's uh, the first chance to see Gleam, so you can get your tickets for that online. And we have some, you know, other special things going on that night. We have some music and a cash bar, um, and you can meet the artists, lighting oh, designers. wonderful. Yeah, and then our artistic director, David Wells, will be there, too, so you can meet him as well. So a great way to meet the artists, learn a little mm -hmm. bit more about this. And you said our, the light is becoming more and more part of sculpture and gardens mm -hmm. all working together. Yeah, it's, it's a big thing in Botanic Gardens right now. Um, so we're proud to bring that to Madison and, um, you know, let people see the gardens in a completely different light. Well, check out the schedule of when things are available. And, of course, you certainly are welcome to join in the opening event on Friday the 26th. Of course, it's best to view this once the sun sets, but yep. that's after 8 mm -hmm. o'clock at this point. So a uh, great time. Thanks so much, yeah, Katie. Thank you.